That usually connects to someone's energy But you're acting used to me Don't act like you used to around me Are you getting tired of Hi guys, welcome back to another video If you haven't read by the title Today I'm going to be doing a little get ready with me For a Valentine's Day photo shoot I say photo shoot, but it's really not like a photo shoot Me and my roommate Julia Are just going to this coffee shop to take some pictures And they're going to be Valentine's Day themed I just have like a cute outfit on I guess and I'm gonna take some pictures with some coffee but I thought I would film a get ready with me because I thought that might be fun. I have to kind of be quiet because I think she's still sleeping but without further ado we can get on into my makeup. I thought it might be fun to share some fun facts while I do my makeup. Not that anyone cares but I don't have anything else to talk about so fun fact number one. I'm Hispanic. I may not look completely Hispanic but my grandma's siblings are all from Bogota, Colombia. I don't know if I even said that right. It is true. So that's really fun. No, I don't speak Spanish because both my parents didn't speak Spanish. I mean, I can understand it and form simple sentences. That's from what I learned in Spanish class. I'm so pale. Next fun fact. I still sleep with my teddy bear. Yep, I said it. I've had this bear since I was about since I was born, I'm pretty sure they bought it in the hospital and I've slept with it every night. I don't plan on getting rid of it anytime soon. I love that thing. He doesn't have his name. His name is just Teddy. I never came up with a name for him. I just didn't feel right. His name is Teddy. That's still kind of a cute name. He's a teddy bear, obviously. What's another fun fact about me? I did all search here for like 14 years maybe? Or been cheering for 14 years at least. And I tried out for the UF cheer team last year. I made finals. But unfortunately, they didn't take anyone because of COVID and all that, which was kind of sad. But hopefully, tryouts will happen next year, and I'll get to try out next year. I've still been practicing with a couple people, and I met a few people, and it's been really fun. So I didn't know there was, like, an all-star gym around here. And then I found it, and so I decided to go to open gym to tumble on the spring floor before I start tumbling again because I haven't tumbled in like six months probably. So I decided to do it on the spring floor to get used to it again. So that was like two days ago and then yesterday, the day after I tumbled, I was already a little sore and then I went to go stunt. And today I'm like, can't even, couldn't even walk when I got out of bed. The worst type of sore is the calves, man. Tomorrow's Valentine's Day, it's so exciting. Robert and I are going to Olive Garden for dinner and I don't really know what else we're doing in the day. Should be fun. I'll show you my outfit in a little bit, but I've worn this before. There's a picture on my Instagram. If you guys wanna check out my Instagram, it's at Riley Andrews. It's also in the description. My eyes are puffy, I'm so tired. It's honestly not even that early. It's like 10 o'clock, 10.30 almost. I'm really excited to try the different coffee shops around here. I guess there's a lot of cute places downtown, but I actually have only been there one time. This mascara is supposed to be really good. It's called Sky High by Maybelline New York. I don't know how I feel about it. I feel like it works well, but I think I've had other mascaras that have done better. I'm so excited for summer. I don't know about you guys, but I literally cannot wait. I'm so pale. My hair is dark. I'm gonna look like Snow White. All right, well, I need to start on my hair. Time lapse. To know, cause baby, when push comes to shove, I need someone around, someone to hold me down. And I wonder how you think of me, detailed and intricately. Do you see me and everything? Cause I wanna know. done i did put the two little braids in it i just look really pale and tired look at these what is that 
I just need to put some jewelry on. I think these earrings would actually be perfect. These are from Ana Luisa. I love the brand. You guys should totally check them out. This is not sponsored. Ooh, pretty. Rings are also Ana Luisa. My little Minnie Mouse ring is from Disney Springs. Pearl bracelet is thrifted. Julia got me this one and Alex and Ani. For my shoes, I'm wearing my Converse. They have a cute little red stripe. Not that you'll see my shoes in the photos, but once I put my shoes on, I'll give you some outfit details. My room's a little messy, so don't mind that. But here's the completed outfit. So my earrings are Ana Luisa. My necklace is from Forever 21. My top is the Eloise top from Princess Polly. My jeans are actually from... TJ Maxx. I forget what brand they are, but they're super stretchy and comfortable and they're made out of recycled material, I think. And then my shoes are Converse. I like the fit. It's uh, it's comfy. It's cute. Got my little braids. Can't really see them, but I think we're now gonna go to get some coffee. I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. Period. Bring me flowers so know that you still care. Bring me flowers so know that you still there. Bring me First look. So cute! The front is adorable! Like in my dinosaur mask. pictures for a while now we actually sat inside for a minute and then we realized it's it was too quiet. too quiet it's more of like a study place they get coffee and study i guess i got the classic which is um espresso with milk cinnamon, cinnamon and honey it's, it's pretty good look at how cute this table is i love this style table and there's white walls <laughs> <laughs> little PSA if you're ever congested if you're ever stuffy don't drink milk don't do lactose because it'll make it worse I've known that but I wanted coffee and I've wanted like ice cream so I've done it anyways and I end up way more congested than I was before I wish the earrings got more time to shine in these pictures I'm too pale to be wearing red lipstick tea anyways oh Duh, I can rate the coffee. So the espresso is not strong at all. It actually tastes good with everything in it. I just don't like honey. How did you get it? Because I thought it would just like make it sweet. I didn't think it was going to be like a can honey you taste, flavor. Can taste the honey? Yes. But it's not bad. I don't hate it. Like I'll drink it. But if you put, if you do it with the straw, that's all you taste is the honey. But if you taste it like normal, it tastes like coffee. You know what? I kind of like it. I'd give it like a 7 out of 10. 6.5 out of 10. I think we're about ready to go. This place was Pascal's Coffee House at the Christian Study Center in Gainesville. It's like right off of university. Might be the new study spot. Actually, no. I get weird vibes in here. I don't know. It's too quiet for me. <laughs> yeah, it's so quiet. It could use like a little bit of like slow music, even classical music. I don't know. It needs something. But other than that, that was a great little photo shoot. Great Valentine's Day photo shoot. Coffee place <laughs> bring me flowers so know that you still care bring me flowers so know that you still there bring me flowers would you bring me i do not know what was wrong with me during this video but that was an interesting one if you stayed to this point thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed this video make sure to give it a thumbs up comment down below if you are in the Gainesville area and you know of any cute coffee shops I definitely want to try them out and maybe even make it into a video. So if you know any places, let me know. And after you do that, I will see you in my next video.